Getting lots of promising candidates to apply for a position in your organization is just the beginning of the recruitment process. In today's show, we share our experts' advice on getting the interview process right, so you end up with the perfect person for the job. It is absolutely vital to enter the recruitment and interviewing process, knowing exactly what you want from the successful candidate. Never rely on, I'll know it when I see it, or vague descriptions like, we want someone to take us to the next level. If you don't know precisely what you're looking for, you might make a bad hire because you really like a candidate, even though they're not a good fit. You might cast too wide a net and waste time interviewing unsuitable candidates, so write a clear, up-to-date job description for the role. Beyond this written job description, make sure you know exactly what the person will do on a daily basis. What problems will they be expected to solve? Develop a clear picture of the ideal candidate, their skills, motivations and behavioural style. Think carefully about what qualities you can coach and which you can't. For example, if you really need someone who is charming and funny to work with clients, then prioritise that trait above experience because those are qualities you can't teach. When companies end up disappointed with their hiring decisions, very often it is the candidate's behaviour rather than their performance that is the root of the problem. So a great talent acquisition strategy needs to look at candidates' attitude to work, adaptability and openness to learning new skills. It needs to consider what a person is capable of as well as what they have already done. Often, understanding of how a person thinks is just as useful as learning about their job history when it comes to determining their future potential. For example, when the United States voted in Barack Obama, they did not choose him based on his track record. They chose him based on their belief that he could do the job. So your interview and recruitment processes need to look at the candidate as a whole person, at their emotional intelligence as well as their technical skills and experience. Skills can be taught, but culture fit is intangible and critical to your long-term success. Ask the candidate to tell you about times when they face major setbacks. Listen carefully to how they respond. Is their style a good match with your company culture? It takes time to weed out unsuitable candidates and identify the people for serious consideration. There is automated software for screening CVs, but nothing beats human involvement. The most rigorous recruitment processes involve phone interviews, screening questionnaires and personality profiling, as well as face-to-face -face interviews. All of this takes time. Also, if you're serious about hiring true talent instead of mediocre players, you need to involve high-level managers, and these managers need to know how to interview effectively. However, it's not just managers you need to be involved in the interview process. At Google, recruiting decisions are often based on a group consensus rather than one individual's assessment. Their interview process includes not only bosses and peers, but also junior team members. They believe that the best assessment of a candidate comes when the views of the entire team are taken into account. Once you have an interview strategy that works for you and that everyone in your organisation buys into, follow it consistently. Don't rush the interviews, don't cut corners and don't rely solely on your gut instinct. Your process must include building a clear, accurate picture of the applicant's past prior to the interview. You must also include a schedule of thoughtful probing questions. Aim to interview so well that the candidate leaves feeling like they've learned something new about themselves. Finally, always, always check references. Don't allow yourself to be spun by candidate stories about their accomplishments without independently verifying them. If you can avoid it, don't rely on a recruiter to conduct the reference checks. Getting the right person is too important to delegate this step. Leverage your networks to find people who have worked with a candidate in the past and get their perspective. Stay tuned for more essential tips from the business experts on Your Business Channel's talent and recruitment series. Now you can collaborate with world-class experts and thousands of business people to solve your biggest problems in business. Simply log in to Your Business Channel and put your question to our editorial team. You can also post your questions on YouTube, Facebook or Twitter. 
I'm sure you can see how it will work for you. It's all about solving your problems fast. There are also low risk and results based options if you'd like more help. Sign up today.